welcome to another episode of Check Out Basket. Today, we're checking out, well, it's not new. It, well, it is new. It's back. It's the Cadbury's Dairy Milk Marble Chocolate. Now, I didn't even know it went away. So that shows you how much I actually go and buy chocolate bar, or chocolate blocks. But it, they did take it away and they've brought it back. This is what it looks like. I've separated it into two fingers, one for my offsider who sits off camera to help you and me figure a few things out. One, why did they take it away and does this actually still taste like the original? That's right, it's taste test time. All right, so these aren't more of a new thing, they're more of a I'm back thing. Cadbury's took away the dairy milk marble. Don't know why, they just did. and. These are now back. Why would they take I away the marble? Don't know. Why like, did they take away the caramel? True. They've still got the top deck though, haven't they? Yeah. Yeah. Because you can't beat the top deck. Top top deck is one of the top decks, and these look a little bit like. Some of them look a little bit like that, but they are they, they are still mixed. Oh, they're a soft toner. Oh, we're going for a taste, are we? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Mm. That's what I remember about Marvel. That outer shell, mm -hmm. having that nice, 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 nice. That nice chocolate centre. That's not hard chocolate. Sort of a whipped, airy, airy, airy uh, mousse kind of a chocolate. Mm -hmm. All right, score time. Just leaking here. <laughs> Salivating. Mm. Well, I didn't know they'd gone. Mm. Marble's always been a, a nice, nice one to have. But they came out years ago. Yeah. I mean, before your time. I know. They've been around for a while. And um, yeah, they're nice. Um, I can't fault them. They're a chocolate. They've got a soft centre. They've got the marbly, marbly outside. I'm giving them a five. I can't give you anything else but. Sorry. Right. You're betting so, on this stuff, aren't you? No, no. Without knowing, what do you think the block size is weighted? Without looking at what 200? No. They used to be 200. Mm -hmm. They used to, the, all the blocks of chocolate were 200 grams. This is 173. Really? 173. So maybe them taking it away was taking it away to then bring okay. it back as a smaller size. Just just putting it out there. Maybe. I'm not I'm not I'm not I don't work for Cadbury, so I don't know for sure. But I'm just putting a theory out there into the in, into the uh, internet of internet of things. Maybe the little squares are slightly smaller. Yeah. Maybe they've cut a row off. Have they always been four in a row, or was it always five? I can't remember. You they know? used to be five. This is where they've got me by the the whiskers. Mm. We can't remember. No. Well, if you can remember, tell me. All right, mm. so you've given it a five, of course. Oh. Me, I'm taking a point off because I think they're being a little bit deceptive. Just, just a little bit. Just a little bit. That uh, maybe they've uh, decided to downsize the block so that they can save some money and uh, trick us into thinking it's still the same size. So I'm giving it a four, you're giving it a five. That's a nine out of ten. Just remember if you see anything you like in these videos, make sure you give us some thumbs up. And don't forget any comments, questions, or maybe. Other chocolates you've seen that are starting to shrink in size? Tell me about it in the comments field below. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button, not the chocolate bar. <laughs> Actually, hit that chocolate bar up as well and hit that subscribe button and get notified when we do these Check Out Basket episodes, my daily vlogs, Lemon is Well, Cooking with Craig, Car Maintenance, you name it, I film it, it ends up on YouTube. So hit that subscribe button. Until next time, see you in the next video. I reckon I'm onto something there. I think you might be onto something. I know that Cadbury's used to be about two, 
to 250 grams. You know, a glass and a half yeah. of full cream dairy milk. They were 250 before 200. Yeah. Now, the trouble is, though, you might be putting up a little protest here, but it's not going to mean anything to the company. No, but it's just, I know I'm calling them out on it. Yeah. They don't care. They're a multi, multi-million multi dollar international company that makes chocolate and doesn't bring all of the flavours to Australia. I've been notified by somebody really? on YouTube that there is a new caramel flavour out. Caramel flavour with hokey pokey in it. And not in Australia? Not in Australia. What only country? only our friends only our friends over the ditch. In New Zealand? That's right. They get them. How come New Zealand gets them? Because it? they make them. <laughs> Why don't they They made the caramel milk and we had it imported. And uh, yeah, they've now got a new variety of caramel milk called Hokey Pokey. Come on, Hokey Pokey, you New Zealanders. So, if any of my New Zealand friends are watching this, and I know I have a few of them, yeah. Kiora, get in mate. touch with me uh, and uh, see if we can organise something about maybe shipping some of those uh, beautiful caramel chocolate new bars over to me. We'll even... We'll... I'll even give you a shout out for it and... Maybe send you a PayPal amount. We'll even do a hacker for it. Hookity, 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 pooty. No, that's no, just wrong. That's All right. Wrong, <laughs>